I'm Renee Mongela, and I'm a member of the NHS board and co-chair of the Tourist Committee. Right now, we're looking out my kitchen uh, French doors to the patio in the back garden. Uh, this is where I like to sit in the mornings, have a cup of coffee. Um, it's east facing. Mostly there's herbs here, uh, a few fragrant plants. It looks over on the patio below. I've lived here for over 35 years, and during that time, I have done, planted a lot. It was originally just lawn with a sad weeping birch in the center. There's a seating area on the patio below. Um, my effort to have a little vegetable garden with lettuce in the containers, and this Rosa Darlow's Enigma, which I did at a propagation uh, class that Riz Ray taught years ago. It's in a 12-inch con container right now, and it was pretty well behaved for a while, and now it's going crazy. But um, it's fragrant, and I think I'm just going to have to move it pretty soon. I want to focus on the shady area of the patio by the Japanese maple in particular. Um, I've been doing some planting there. There's a Brunnera Jack Frost, a Japanese painted fern, a Hosta June Woodwardia fern, and there's some Hakedia, uh, Hakedia that has these neon yellow colored flowers in the spring some uh, epimedium and as we can step in a little closer uh, there's a summon substance hosta and in the background there there is some thimbleberry which I try to keep under control but it does provide a little bit of structure so. my plans for the future include clearing out the vinca at the, that's taken over at the back of the garden and then adding some screening along the back fence. My Seattle garden might be small, but there's always something to do. Thanks for visiting.